up, Dream Team? It's your girl, Neek, and I'm here, and I'm back again with another new and improved video. So today, guys, I will be doing a prank on my boyfriend. I download this app, and I develop, like, you know, a conversation as if I was actually talking to a actual boy. So, um, basically, the prank is, is this. I send the wrong message to my boyfriend or accidentally send in um, pictures to my boyfriend. Because what I'm about to do, right, since I already, um, since I would already um, set up the chat, you know, on my phone, acting as if, you know, I was talking to this boy, right? And so what I'm going to do is screenshot um, the chat. And then I'm going to send it to him, pretending like i talking to my best friend. You know what I'm saying? So let's get into this prank. So before we get into this prank, though, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you get notified every time I post a brand new banger. Okay, guys. Okay, so I've already screenshot parts of the conversation and now we're gonna go from here and i'm also gonna make sure I screen record so y'all could get it from the angle of me and him talking after i accidentally sent him pictures of me talking to this boy okay okay so i screen So I'm gonna go into my WhatsApp and go on my boyfriend chat and start recording the um, whole thing so you guys can see, you know. So I'm sending him the pictures right now and I'm also putting a message there like I say pretending like I talking to my bestie so I can be like bestie girl look at this fine boy flirting with me. And I'm, I'm going to put the laughing face and I'm going to put the the hard eyes. I'm going to put the heart with like the vibrating heart emoji. And I'm going to send it. I'm going to send it. I send it and then now I'm going to go offline so I pause the screen recording until he answer and then I'm going to pick the screen recording up when I see he messaged me. Oh my gosh. That's about to be crazy. Okay. Whew. But I'm nervous a little bit. So his reaction. But I'm not nervous overall. Because I know I was not actually talking to a real person. And I would not cheat. Me and my boyfriend been in a relationship for three and a half years now, and I don't plan on jeopardizing that with this foolery. I can 
gold like and see if I see the bar a lot if we if we are looking at the masses I had to delete it guys I had to delete it because I I realized I did not cover the fact that the chat literally have a little small um thing that says say chat so I have to actually go ahead and re So I deleted, yes, and I have to resend it to him and make sure I cover up the fact that it said um, fake chat, okay? Because I would be literally ruining the prank for myself and it wouldn't, would have been actually even starting properly yet, you know what I'm saying? So I can't have that. So I'm going to go ahead and use like the white little pen thingy to cover up the fact that that says fake chat. And I got to try to do it with a doing the masses. Okay, so let's edit this one as well. And you guys are going to see what I'm talking about in my screen recording. I'm trying to be like a professional. And Talk about your your hair. I'm trying to figure out. Okay, I think that should be good enough. You know. And I'm just gonna send the same exact replica message that I was gonna send him the first time, which is you know best thing just because it's fine while he's looking at me. Resend it to him now, guys. Whew. Okay, so he got two texts, which means he was received the message, and we're just gonna look. He doesn't wait. He doesn't know wait. Is he? He doesn't know wait. Is he? Can we find him? I can't. I didn't send him the whole message, and I'm just hoping that he don't take too long. He already can come online and see it because he was just online, like about close to two o'clock, and it's like two something p.m. So. I think I did good. I think I did good as hell. I think I did good as hell because I think I just think I did good as hell. And also, I have all the receipts, all the evidence, all the facts that you know this is just a motherfucking prank. You can see where I got the picture from. Um, for the boy, you know, you can see the where I got the pictures from. Obviously, I used one of my real pictures in the conversation when we was sending each other pictures of each other to um see like you know that each other like you know like you guys like I used a real photo of myself. And then I used a photo of him. And I actually had to screenshot the picture and then crop out the top, you know, the top, the notification bar and stuff from my phone to make it seem like we know it was somebody took a picture of him and then he sent it to me. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Lord, there. Hopefully the name make it convincing. Even if the name don't make it convincing, I'm pretty sure that's like, I'm pretty sure since, like, um, the way I was talking, probably my catch, my catch up off time. But you know, like a boy would be trying to flirt with me and honestly, I, if I even decide, if I even decide that I'm fine, I'm just gonna knock it off. And if I can't get very off point, so I'm just gonna knock it off and just go my way. So after he, I didn't see like his intentions is to flirt with me and you know, um, get me in trouble. I just don't follow his chat. I either apart him, block him, or just don't answer. You know, that would just be one of those chats sitting on my list, like me not asking people because I'm not having it. See, 
see he sent the message guys guys he respond let me show you guys what he say y'all see what he say he said sorry what the uh-uh i was expecting a better reaction from him oh okay now i'm gonna be like oh my gosh oh i'm gonna be like oh my gosh i thought you was my best friend <laughs> i thought i sent this to my best friend you know what i'm saying I'm going to put like a shock emoji. Oh my gosh. Like, you know, like, oh my gosh. So I'm basically going to send it, right? And, and then, since I sent that message, like, oh my God, I thought this, I sent this to my bestie and then I could be like sorry honey with a little kissy face you know to like sweet him up and see what he say man he need to go for this prank man he need to go for this prank So I can come back once he respond, okay guys? I can back once he respond. Oh my gosh, he respond already. Say it's okay. The, no, you supposed to be mad. I asked him if he mad. He's supposed to be mad. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, he's supposed to be a mod. He say no. Oh my freaking gosh, why is he not mad? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I wanted him to be a mod and then play into that emotion and then be like, oh, honey, it's a freaking prank. Like, this is going the whole, this is going a whole other way, okay? <laughs> I wasn't expecting this. I thought he would have get mod. Mm, I guess sometimes, like, when you prank people, you know, Based upon their mood or how they day going or something, so they don't re get they don't react the way you really want them to. Oh, uh, you know how relationships is. You know you go through some trying times. You go through certain things in a relationship, and then it just have a person like okay, I'm not even mad at you. But I wanted him to be mad. He texting guys. He texting. He texting. He texting. Let's see what he say. But I wanted him to be a little bit mad. I want him to be mad to the point where he really blocked me because we got some stuff coming for you. <laughs> like that's all I about to say. We got some. I'm just gonna put the eye looking and say okay. Man, I don't. This prank about to be short as hell. Well, I can put okay and see what he say. No, I. Mm, should I ask him if he want break up with me? No. 
I can no. Should I ask them if? What should I ask them, guys? Tell me what I should ask them. Celebrity. I got ask him if he don't love me anymore. Guys, I go. Uh, this could be hilarious. I'm telling you, when y'all see this, y'all gonna find this hilarious because I have the chat that basically feels like all my hard work going on the journey because I was expecting for him to be mad and he just so. I'm on and chill about it. Not even get mad. Taking the high road, basically. So, hmm. As I wait, as I wait, as I wait, as I wait. Should I call him, guys? I can call him on camera. I'm gonna call him on camera. Hopefully I'm gonna copy and Guys, I can catch y'all when he answer. So he said, love you too. I'm busy pulling clothes off the line. Can you give me a minute? No, I can be like, no, honey, something happened. Like, you know, like all of a sudden there's an emergency. I can be like, something wrong with me and I'm home by myself. I am home by myself. But I trying to draw him to tell him it's a freaking prank. Y'all, this is a definitely prank going wrong and unexpected. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, let's try to call him again. Honey, I got a kind of very good thing, but then I be like, uh, honey, it's a prank, you know. There was a couple. Uh, honey. I know, but I need you. Yeah. I have something to tell you. What's up? What is tough? You listening? Yeah. Look, put your face in the camera, please. Huh? <laughs> put your face in the camera. Hold on, I got clothes in my hand. Alright, alright, alright. Anyways, I can just tell you. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> why, why you say it yeah like that? You sound so funny. 
All right, y'all. So what I want to tell you is it's a freaking prank. So you are being screen recorded right now for my video and I have the next camera, the next phone on me recording me on the other camera. So yeah, this is a freaking prank, honey. You know, I wasn't, I, we can talk about that. We got to talk about that off camera because I tell them, you know, I got it from offline and all that stuff. And I had to crop the picture and make it seem real. I say, hold on. I was like, we can talk about it once I finish closing this video. Because I already tell them that, you know, I had, I screen, shot the picture and crop it and all that. But hold on, let me end off the video now because I don't want to be too long. But yes, guys, you've seen the prank went unexpected because I really wanted him to be mad. But he didn't even get mad. He had this nonchalant, chill vibe like, yeah, you know, okay, you know, I still love you. Sorry, but, you know. audience, so so this young lady who has been a busy day and i really really did not my heart into it so uh, i'm sorry if i disappointed plenty of people i mean that's a good thing that's just bringing the show in like different content from the usual you know set of youtubers you know they prank each other and they usually with this kind of you know i was telling them with this cheating and certain kind of stuff um, their partner get mad, but you don't usually see, like, when you prank your partner about cheating or certain type stuff, like, they just take the high road or the nonchalant road or, you know, the chill road, like, you know, that's just life, you know. But anyways, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you can get notified every time I post another new and improved video guys i hope you enjoyed this video although you know the reaction probably might not be unexpected and for some of you you probably might like the reaction because you've never seen much youtubers excuse that sound um you might never see um other youtubers playing their boyfriend or girlfriend and really had this kind of reaction but yeah so this is it guys um wait before i go you guys let me know if you like these pranks let me know what kind of pranks you want me to do okay on my boyfriend my mommy my stepdad my little baby brother my grammy my cousin them because i love to see all of them and every last one of them need to get freaking prank okay you feel me so let me know which pranks you want me to do let me know what challenges you want me to do with them too let me know what other video ideas you have okay peace dream team i wish i screen record this the whole time and plus i